Glad everybody made it out today. So uh, what you probably know is this is Spirit Week and we've also uh, taken our Beacon Awards and have combined them all in the same week. So we give our Employee of the Year Beacon Award um, Monday and our Physician of the Year yesterday. And this is our third annual Advanced Practitioner Award. And uh, we had 26 nominations, uh, 12 different providers and happy to say oh you're goodness. being recognized. Thank you so <laughs> Thank you so much. <laughs> yeah. So congratulations, and uh, we're gonna have a little bit of conversation here. I'm gonna let Kelly tell you a little more about the award itself. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Sure. So um, this award, as Ronnie said, is the third year, and it recognizes the outstanding efforts of our providers and team members who support our mission of taking care of Dare County's visitors and residents. But I do want to share with you the selection criteria. So. As we look at um, selecting our provider, we base it on team member experience, patient experience, which you're nationally in the top 15% of um, quality initiatives, um, and leadership and mentoring, but also community involvement. And so that is uh, how we base our portfolios and, and do our selection. And I'm going to let uh, Lynn read some of the nominations, and we have a few other people that are going to talk with you today as well. We are so excited, Chris, and it's it's just perfect that you're getting ready to head into your third year with us, and you are also our third year APP, so thank you for that. Congratulations. I do want to share with you um, a couple of the nominations and what your, what your team and what your community shared with us about you. Um, you have been a great combination of clinical acumen, commitment to excellence, and great communication skills. And that makes you all, and all of that makes you an integral part of the many patients' health care teams that you serve. You coordinate very well with specialists and keep the patient at the center of focus for all of your health care decisions. And it's been really fun for us to get to watch your family grow <laughs> as you come back home to Eastern North Carolina. It, we've been able to share lots of great milestones with you and are thrilled that this is one of those to add to your list of your time with us. So thank you so much for all that you do. I'll hand it over to Tia to share more. So this is for the nomination for you. Chris practices up-to-date evidence-based medicine and focuses on truly getting to know each patient. He believes in providing patient education to make the best decisions for long-term wellness. Chris has shown his commitment to these beliefs in his day-to-day -day patient care. You embody patient advocacy. You led that blood pressure education class um, that led to the Quality Award. Um, we had to stop the classes because of COVID, but we know that you continue to monitor your patients and make sure that their lifestyle leads to a healthy blood pressure. You embody collaboration. You were one of the first providers, the first provider in Manio that participated in the pharmacist and clinic program. You embody quality. You receive recognition for most improvement overall, going from 29th percentile up to 89th percentile in patient satisfaction. And you embody community involvement. You participated in our free sports physicals for Manual High School students in 2019, and you were a lifeguard in Hillbilly. <laughs> <laughs> and leadership. You've mentored and precepted two nurse practitioner students, and you've only been here three years. Um, you live our ICE's values every day and contribute to achieving our overall mission. But most importantly, for the team, you have a joyful, generous, loving Sorry, spirit, and that provides light to all of us, and it makes us feel better every day. Thank you. Yay, we are so <laughs> proud of you. Um, you might be a little bit surprised, but I think I speak for all of our team, like we are not surprised about this award for you at all because of your knowledge, your compassion, um, and most of all, you're just like kindness. And your nurse, Kim, of course. Yeah. <laughs> um, but this has not, this is not a surprise for us. So we are so proud and so happy. Congratulations. Thank you so much. Yeah. I appreciate it. Yeah.
And you can at least get the big, big, nice piece of glass. Oh my goodness. There you go. Wow. Yeah. There you go. I'm like kind of scared to hold it. Yeah. 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 you're happy you say anything you'd like to say? Uh, gosh, I, I'm speechless. Uh, <laughs> I, you know, it's just, um, you know, I've said this throughout my time as a PA. I mean, I'm just, you know, it's an honor to be able to be a part of my patients' lives, you know, and they trust me with, you know, the most valuable thing in their life is their yeah. health care. And it's just a privilege to do this job every day. And, you know, you guys and everybody here mm. makes it possible for me to do it as best as I can. Um, and yeah, I think this is just one of the nicest things I've ever mm. gotten. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you so much. Oh, yeah. Very nice, very nice.